I fought my butt off that night. I fought really, really hard, uh, especially in the second round because I thought I was down one round. And so I went out in the second and I fought as hard as I could. Mm. And, um, I, you know, I tried all the tricks that I knew to get her down on the cage, try and get on top and win the next round. And uh, I think she's just a really strong fighter and she was in the zone that night. So um, I don't, I won't take anything away from Nico. She was awesome and she was awesome that night. And uh, she's actually just a really cool girl. So yeah. <laughs> it was, to me, it's an honor to see her coming up, yeah. you know, and uh, for me, it's just a lesson. The next fight, I have to relax. Uh, I'm gonna keep getting better and just look forward to the future. All right, well, that's the first of our Troll Booth questions, folks. RJ is gonna have his eye on social media all show long. If you wanna get involved, use the hashtag Tough Talk and your tweets may just make it on the air. But uh, obviously, we're talking about the fight with Nico. Um, did you think that you were gonna get a third round out of it, though? I did. Yeah. I was mm. really hoping that it would be pushed to a third round and um, I felt like maybe she was getting tired. I thought if it goes to a third, that means that I've won at least one round. I know I can win the third. And I was really disappointed when uh, Herb Dean said that they had reached a decision because I knew that that meant that she well, was taking the win. Do you think if you would just gone out there and tried to strike with her instead of looking to take it down, you think it would have been different? Uh, maybe, but because she was a southpaw, I was actually pretty nervous about trying to win those striking exchanges because yeah. southpaws move off in different directions than you expect. Tricky. This guy will tell you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, they, 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 they are a pain, but it's very tiring trying to take somebody down. Were you gassing in the fight at all? I didn't feel like it. Um, after watching the fight, I, I looked to myself like I had slowed yeah. down a little bit. But in the fight, I didn't feel that way. But the game plan was to take her down. And I'm like a, I'm like a dog on a game plan. Like, I will <laughs> commit to that game plan. I will try it until the bell rings, beginning to end. And so the game plan was to put her on the cage, take her down, get on top, and either finish or at least, like, do some brutal ground and pound so that there's no question who's winning the fight. And I just I could not complete the takedown. Well, she did land a lot of kicks in there. Were mm -hmm. you damaged by any of those? Were they, were they throwing you off your game? Um, they, I knew they didn't look good. Yeah. <laughs> I wasn't happy about it. Yeah. Um, but it was, and it was hard to time. And yeah. um, every time I thought, okay, I'm gonna step in on the next kick, she would throw one at a different angle, or she would come from a different angle, or throw the different side kick, you know? And so it was really hard for me to time to step in and hit her. And the few times that I did, she moved off at an angle, so. Well, yeah, yeah. It was difficult. <laughs> it was, it was, it was, the fight game. Absolutely. It was a tough That's the fight. way it goes. <laughs>